Hall. Right, so this is the Sunday, the third Sunday of February with the Caledonian Hill walking. In the Pentland areas on this one, the Nine Mile Burns, uh, Nine Mile Burn, and we're heading to West Glinton. We're going via some of the hilltops over there. So this is the starting point, so we got dropped off. Burn. And we're heading up over the hills and end up at West Linton. <coughs> so it's, an, it's estimated to be about 11 miles, 11, 12 mile hike, and the highest point will be something like 500 metres. So, uh, as usual, I'll do my best to get as much footage as I can throughout the hike and uh, share it with you on here. So I'm in a slightly faster group today, so I'll just be kind of hit a limit how much it take. This is a faster moving group then. And so I'll just say I'll just try and get as much footage as I can, but most of the time I'll be saying be keeping up with them. So. so there are a couple of hull tops that we'll be climbing over. Uh, some up and downs on this one. I'll just get as much as I could. There's not as much time in this, it's more hiking. Uh, I'll get the names of the hills when I get up there, share it on here. Makes it on there. It does, yeah, that's the thing. Yeah. But don't you? It's windy, a wee bit milder. <laughs> There's an area down here. I think they'll stop here for a cup of tea as well, a cup of coffee or whatever. This will be the best thing to show. So 
to have a buck in the move again. Buck in the move. of ups and downs. Uh, we've just literally been hill walking today. West Lynn. So this is a real hill walk. This hill walk's been quite tiring. It's been lots of uh, climbing up and then back down again to climb back up again. It's been a hilly walk. This is the old hill walk by the day, by name and by definition. But literally a hill walk. It's been like this all the start. Just climbing up hills, back down. Back up, back down. So it is a Pentland Hills after all. So walking the Pentland Hills is a hill walk. Tiring but still gonna be done. the airport which is see if you get it on the camera. Oh, there it is. See yeah, just ducking off here there. No, it's not the same. and Angus in the distance there as well, way on the horizon. We're just a little uh, 
get much break, we're going to really start moving again. So in addition, you can actually see, see Freeport, see if you can see it. That's Freeport in the distance. find out what that lock's called and make sure. So we're heading down to what's Harper Rig Reservoir here. I don't know how well I came to it. But <laughs> I think the wind's probably blocked a lot of the sound out. This is the sum of East Cairn Hill. Harper Rig Reservoir. Again, and then back down. So there's still plenty of hogs to climb here, and they're quite tired on this one. Just to get the fourth floor bridge, you can see the lights flashing on the top. I don't know if it's coming out on the camera, but they're certainly flashing. Uh, I can see them. Uh, it'll be the blood fog lights or something. Uh, I don't know where that came out that time, but it's probably because there's a lot of cloud and fog starting to switch on the. The uh, lights at the top, they sort of flash intermittently. I just beefed up on uh, players, airplanes, and that because there's an airport quite nearby, so aircraft and stuff. So that's the new Queen's Ferry crossing across the River Forth, and you can see the uh, fourth rail bridge. If you can zoom in on that, if it's a bit more focused, but. So we just came down from there, which is quite a steep descent, and then we've got to go. Over that hill, and then back down the other side. So, and that's the other that reservoir that I saw from the hilltop earlier. Well, that's right. yeah, so it's there's a glider in the distance here. I'm trying to get it on the video, but I don't know what's coming out. I know it's a thing about my nose diving in the crater itself. It's probably doing some kind of flying exercise or something. So, I've still got another glider to do. That's the one that just came off of. I'm just coming down there, a steep descent. And then we're going to be basically heading back up and possibly even to the top of that hill as well. So, just got to see what happens. So there's still five miles to go and uh, we've done all these hills. Okay. <laughs> it's about March to get to the West Linden. So this is a proper hill walk. Five miles at all these hills to go still. We've got just under two hours to do it as well. So it's like pretty much March we want. We're getting back to civilization. That's to say, it's quite tiring. Nice view up. Shepherd. So let's get a nice view of this reservoir here on the left. So we're just coming into West Linton now, another half mile. So I even saw a horse and carriage on the hike as well. So 
Oh, that's his back. Oh, that was a long hike. That was a tired one, but uh, yep. Got some footage during it anyway. And this is West Linton's where the end point is. So it was a three walk, but 12 miles. This is back. So I think we're going there for the, going to the hotel for a drink, you know? So that's it, I'm just going to round the video off now. Oh, it's tiring. So, um, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I'm totally exhausted. So, uh, hope you enjoyed. Right, thanks for watching. See you on the channel. Catch you later. Bye.